What's up, everyone? So I got some good riding in today. It's actually really nice. I got some pretty good air, too, and fell. Right at the end of the trail, too, is kind of funny. I'm actually kind of hoping to run into more trails. I stopped to take a break. It's actually fucking wearing this, dude, it sucks. But it, it's, it's worth it. <laughs> But I need to take a break, man. Right before I, uh, like the first uh, two trails, I, uh, you know, I I rode them and then I had to stop for a second. And uh, before I hit that third trail, because I knew it was going to be rough, and I stopped and grabbed a Red Bull and some sugar, some fucking, bought some Skittles and some sweet tarts for later. But they have bathrooms and stuff over here. It says, uh, Roadside Development and the Haggerty Comfort Station. This comfort station was one of the early public rest stops, and it was a prototype for roadside development. When originally constructed in 1937, the station had a full-time attendant, an information booth, and a concession stand. Wayne County was one of the first county road agencies in the United States to officially promote the Good Roads Movement, setting procedures for design, construction, and maintenance of roadside developments. And this is the bottom right here, but this is you ought to know. Jesse Merle Bennett established 23 roadside comfort stations in Wayne County parks and many other, uh, many others along state highways. And there's a picture of them. That's what it, the building originally looked like. This is it. This is an original historic rendering of Haggerty Comfort Station drawn on tracing paper, 1936. Drawing courtesy of Wayne County Parks. And then, as this picture says, the popularity of Heinz Park in the 1930s and 40s is revealed by the crowds outside the Comfort Station in 36, courtesy of Wayne County Parks. You see everybody. They're all dressed nice, too, you know? And then there he has little geeky glasses. Uh, Jesse Merle Bennett, the first superintendent of Wayne County Park System, was one of the first people to see the need for roadside comfort stations along highways for the traveling public, leading to leading to today's travel centers. And then a uh, photo courtesy of Wayne County Park. So these are all, you know, they're probably public records they had, you know. People probably sourced them. So... I'm getting a phone call and I don't want to answer it. It's probably, it's always, a lot of scam shit. I have to use the bathroom. I tried going up here, seeing there was more trails, there isn't. So, I'm gonna head this way to Northville. They got like a disc golf area up there I know of. One of my boys used to go up there and sell a lot of weed. <laughs> I don't know, they're probably all playing over there. That's what they do, go play disc golf and smoke weed. That's why I went up there. And you could get rid of weed pretty easily before it was legal. So, I'm probably gonna, I gotta upload everything on the memory card and clear it on the laptop. So, I, uh, show you guys what I bought today. I just, you know what's stupid is, I went to donate plasma. Not only did I have problems, when I stopped donating, the last few times I've had problems. It's taking too long. Like, my vein doesn't, you know, it doesn't, I don't know. They keep on poking me in the same spot. I don't really like donating anyways. I really don't. But, uh, you know, that's funny because the app said that I had 50 bucks coming, and they told me 50 bucks last time. But that was two weeks ago, and I didn't go show up for two weeks, which... Because the last time I went, I was it took two hours, you know, three hours. It was terrible. They, you know, it hurt, you know. They kept on trying to go in me, like, you know, poke it in and out, in and out. Stupid shit. And I didn't want a hematoma. I've had one before. That shit hurts. And uh, I only got 35 bucks today, so I just bought food, really. I went to Jimmy John's, and I bought a water, um, an oatmeal cookie, the candy I mentioned. I bought a tuna uh, sub, a number 15 tuna club. But, uh, yeah, I bought the, and I uh, bought a loaf of bread for a dollar. It's usually 50 cents, but I gave them a tip. And uh, I bought a Fiji water. And then that's it, really. You know, I got my tools. 
That's the only thing wrong with all this weight, man. I got my tools, the laptop, the water. Dude, carrying water is actually really heavy. It sucks. You know, I got the bread. Which, the fresh bread, I bought it because it's only 50 cents, you know. And it's fresh. And it's fresh bread. My favorite's the end, the butts. Those are the best. And, like, this will last me until tomorrow, you know. I'll eat that tonight until, until tomorrow. I'll be gone tomorrow. So, I'm about to... I'll probably snack on that a little bit. I want to save my candy for later. I like to eat candy before I go to bed a lot when I lay in bed for some reason. Became a habit in prison. It's like a comfort thing, you know? You don't have much in there, so, you know? Sometimes it got rough in there, you know? It got stretched thin, you know? And a bag of sweetest fish, you know? It's, <laughs> makes all the difference. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, upload this. That's another thing. You don't... Electronics don't last in the sun either. They don't. Like, see how it fell over? It's in the sun. I had it propped up like that. And they don't cook. Melt and shit. Serious. And then the computer will run slow, too, if it's too hot. And this computer, it's all solid state. So... There's no fan on it and shit. You don't hear no fan winding up and stuff. It doesn't really get hot. But if I have it in the sun, it will, so. But yeah, I'm gonna go take care of that, take a piss. I'm probably gonna lay down for a minute. Cause I wanna ride, I wanna ride way that way. Miles, probably like good fucking 10 miles, five miles that way. And then I guess still gotta ride about 15 miles. Depends on how far I ride that way. And then I gotta ride all the way that way, home. I won't be home till tonight. I gotta check my Facebook and shit. See, people message me and fucking for stuff. They buy stuff. and I don't know, man. But I'll see you guys later. Peace out.